Hello guys, in this video, I am going to show you, how to add CGI objects to a video. Open Blender. Select VFX. Load the video clip. Go to Render Properties, go to Color Management, change Filmic to Standard. Go to Output Properties, and increase to Frame Count to 350. Click Detect Features. Reduce the Threshold to 0.1. Change location to perspective. Track the clip forward. Delete the bad tracks. Go to solve. Enable focal length, optical center, and radial distance. Click Solve Camera Motion, now the solve error value is 0.72. We done a good camera track, in the first attempt. Click, Set as Background and Set up Tracking Scene. Now delete everything from the scene except the camera. Align the camera in a correct position. Now I am going to add a subject into the scene. Add an HDRI in the environment. Reduce the strength to 0.2 for now. Add a sun lamp. Increase the angle to 20. I will explain it later. Increase the strength to 3. I just increased the background strength to 0.3. Rotate the sun lamp 45 degrees in Y axis. Go to compositing. Delete all nodes except the composite and the viewer, add a movie clip. Add a render layers. Go to render properties, go to film, and enable transparent. Render the image. Insert a mix node. Connect the render layers to image 2. Connect the alpha to factor. I want this two buildings to be in the front layer. So I did the masking for two buildings. Now add a mask node. And select the mask. Insert a mix node here. Connect the mask to the factor. Connect the movie clip to the image too. Insert a color balance node between the render layers and the mix node. Move the points in the color wheels to blue. Add a hue saturation value. Reduce the saturation to 0.75. I am doing this to match the in red color in the rooftop and the red color in the airship. The resolution of this video is 2K, but I want to render this scene in HD. So I am changing the resolution to default value. Here we have some issues. Add a scale node. Change relative to render size. Insert the node before the movie clip. Duplicate the node. Insert the node before the mask node. Move the point in the gamma color wheel. Towards yellow. I use this building, as my reference, to match the mid-tone. I am going to render the scene in EV. Enable ambient occlusion, bloom, screen space reflections, and motion blur. 
duplicate the airship to add more details to the scene. Go to View Layer Properties and enable Mist. Go to Render Preview. Change Combine to Mist. In World Properties, under Mist Pass, change the values in the start and depth. Render the image. Go to Compositing, insert a mix node. Before the render layers, connect the mist to the factor. Insert a color ramp before the mist. Reduce the white color. I took every color information from the video, in this scene, I didn't add any shadows for the objects, if the sunlight hits the object directly, we want to add sharp shadows, something like this. Sometimes, clouds will block, and will scatter the sunlight. In this situation, we want to add soft shadows. That is the reason, I increased the angle value, if our object lose its contact from the ground, the shadows will disappear. In this scene, the light is coming from all directions. That's why we can't see any shadows. And our object didn't have any contact with the ground. So it is unnecessary to add shadows for the object in this scene. 